We're here at the conclusion of the GP Cyclist Quebec talking to Ryan Anderson from Team Canada, who top team finished today in 27th in the group, just seven seconds behind the uh, the winning group. Uh, Ryan, um, you satisfied with that? Yeah, I mean, uh, I'm pretty satisfied. I mean, uh, maybe I was hoping to be in the top 10, but I think I came into the final kilometer with uh, still the front group. Um, so I had a chance, but just didn't quite have good enough legs in the very finale today. But I think, uh, you know, this race is always won by, uh, you know, someone that's proven in Europe wins a ton of races. Simon Garens is a phenomenal bike racer. There was a ton of good riders in the very front today. So I'm happy with, uh, with the way I rode today. Now, um, the last lap before the last climb, uh, Team Canada had uh, Mike Woods in the uh, in in a break. Um, was that a bit of a plan to try and get try and get somebody like him who who's a climber off the front? Yeah, I think uh, if the race reshuffled like that, we were uh, definitely had Mike Woods on on uh, kind of high alert, looking for uh, something that would have gone in the in the later part of the race when things really started going again. And uh, it was nice to see uh, Michael. Uh, he, you know, he did a nice ride to get in that group. Now, I mean, your late season's been going pretty well. Um, second place in the final stage in Alberta. Um, you know, just seven seconds uh, out, of, out, of the, out of the lead group here. Um, so you, you're pretty pleased with, with your form now at the end of the season? Yeah, definitely. Um, I mean, uh, from Colorado, I didn't get quite any results like I did last year there, but I was still riding well, so that was a focus. Alberta is uh, always important to me. And then finishing uh, with these races is, you know, it's top of the list. So uh, I hope to be good in Montreal, and I'm quite pleased with how things have been going lately. Yeah, let's talk about Montreal. Um, quite a different course. Um, just, you know, one big climb and then a smaller steep climb. Um, how are you feeling about, uh, about that race? Yeah, I mean, lately I've been climbing better than in the past. So, I mean, we're, I think we're just going to have to see. I'm going to hope, uh, hope I can make it over. I think if I can make it over uh, Mount Royal, the last time I have a better chance of, of being a, you know, doing a good result in the finale because here the last 4K are just, you know, extremely hard. So I think if you can make and survive uh, the last bit, it's a little easier into the actual final. So we'll kind of see what happens. Now, might be a little early, but let's talk about uh, next year. Um, any, any idea yet what your, what your plans are, are going to be and team-wise for next year? Yeah, I haven't quite uh, figured that out. I mean, uh, I really enjoy my time with Optum. Uh, it's a great team. So, you know, kind of, um, you know, see how things shape up. I'm, I'm pretty just, just focused on the weekend and kind of see where things go from there. So one last question, Ryan. Uh, Worlds, last big race of the, of the season, really, for a lot of people. Um, what about you? Are, are, are we going to see you at Worlds? Or your form is, is obviously there. Yeah, I mean, I, I really do hope to do the Worlds this year. I think uh, I think this the course, you know, uh, is a little more in my range. It suits me a little more. I mean, obviously, I've never, uh, I haven't done a senior Worlds, but uh, I think my form is good. I think I was good here today. You know, if I'm good in Montreal, I think uh, I would really like to do the Worlds this year. So we're going to have to just see uh, what happens. Great. Well, thanks very much, and uh, we'll see you in Montreal. Perfect. Thanks very much.